What is up guys, Silverrex here and today I'm gonna review the new NECA King Kong figure that just came out or it's gonna come out on or it's gonna officially come out on this on September 9th so yeah I got this figure at Walmart and yeah let's, let's just get into the review quickly the detail of this figure looks amazing like wow this is the this is the this this isn't a this NECA figure is inspired is 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 NECA's original design original King Kong. It's not based on any movie except this 1933 head and the color scheme of Skull Island. Yeah, but it looks cool. The head looks cool. The teeth are well sculpt sculpted and painted. The block texture that he has, the wounds, the eyes is, are well painted. Um, the mouth is well painted and detailed. Chest looks amazing with all the scars and scratches. The brown fur around the body looks pretty amazing. And uh, the all, all the detail that this figure has is just amazing. Just look at him, look at him. Yeah, and... Yeah, the, the feet look nice and detailed. This figure's well painted. This is, ama this is an amazing figure. So, yeah, that's detailed. Now let's go to articulation. So, arti articulation. The head, it can look up, he can look down that much. Can swivel. It's a ball joint, 360. Um, the arms move that. Wait, move that much. His he has a bend at the elbow. His hands, fuck. His hands move. Yeah, very nice. Um, he has like a dorsal. What do you call this? Um, he moves around here. He moves around here. You know, around, like right here. The the feet move this much. They spread this much. They go down together this much. Um, bend at the knee, and there is a hinge at the feet, but it's kind of frozen in place. So I'm not gonna articulated that much so yeah that's articulation now let's take a look at his, his, his accessories he comes with two open hands and fuck he fell <laughs> um he comes he just put him right there he comes with an a more let me just turn off the flash real quick he comes with a more skull island as and let me let me just pop that out uh, that head out. Give me a second. So here are the heads. Um, they look extremely different from each other. Not just because one has a more angry Skull Island looking head, and the other is just a thirty three head. But the paint job is different. Like the eyes are darker, which I like this one more. The mouth is a pinkish instead of that reddish. I don't know how I feel about that, and the teeth here are kind of ble- the paint job on the teeth are bleeding on the gums, which it's, uh, whatever, it's a, it's a quality control, but whatever, I think it's just on mine. And, the uh, fur on the head is lighter on the 33, it's darker on the, on the Skull Island head, I'm just gonna call it Skull Island head. Um... The skin color is a little bit more of a charcoal, charcoal gray with a um with a pinkish, so it can look like you know scratches and it here's just like a almost like dark, very a very charcoal blue color. And I'm gonna have him displaying with this head because I love this head how it looks. So yeah. And these are the hands. I'm not gonna put them on. I'm not gonna waste my time putting them on. 
So yeah, those are the accessories. Now I'm gonna size Kong with a few Godzilla figures. And this is where people is kinda disappointed because this is NECA 2019's Godzilla. Yeah. People don't like how he's bigger than Goji here, but it's just isn't it this isn't a Godzilla vs. Kong or 1962 Godzilla. It's its own thing, so I don't mind it at all. So yeah. If, but if you want to size him up with a Godzilla, I recommend you sizing him up with Kiryu Goji because he's the big he's the biggest Godzilla there is on the neck line. So yeah, let me get him on a post so you can see it how it can um size up good. This is as good as you're gonna get as posting him next to a Godzilla figure that it can look decent. So yeah, this is my review for the NECA King Kong. Stay tuned that I will review this bad boy right here. I love this figure. I got this a day before this guy. So yeah, I'm happy for having both of them. So yeah, I, I love the new King Kong figure. I'm happy that I got it. I got it on Walmart, you know. So yeah, that's my review for the NECA King Kong. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to, and yeah, stay big G-Fans.